Roland Dalbai was born a sculptor, the great student of Mikhail Anikushin, who entered the history of world fine arts. He graduated from the Institute of Painting, Sculpture and Architecture, named after Repin, and the Higher School of Fine Arts of the city of Dresden successfully. He created 20 symbolic monumental ensembles and monuments. It is said that his talent is noticeable, self-righteous, uncompromising and even despotic. Maybe, but there is a surprising thing – the artist's unwillingness to think about the creation, to share doubts and to tell about his work. He thinks that for him his works would speak, and they are embodiment of his thoughts and emotions. Let it be so, and we try to agree with him and intuitively follow him. There are such creators who go beyond the limits of professionalism. This is very important. Sometimes it happens that professionalism is not necessary for the master. I mean, he does everything right, without any fault. And at such moment like this, there is no soul. When there is no soul, only few can cope with it, to break away from the limits of the profession, some installations and concepts. He lives within the limits of his profession. And there, beyond the limits of the profession, begins a real artist. Своего профессионализма, а там уже начинается за пределами профессионализма настоящий художник. Его произведение встречает нас возле входа в музей. Это памятник Абылхану Костеву, и мы очень рады, что в собрании музея находятся две его брошюры. His work welcomes us near the entrance to the museum. It is a sculpture of Abulhan Kastev, and we are very happy that in the Central Museum there are his works, which can be considered the pride of the collection. Any sculpture by Nurlan Dalbay is Michelangelo who said, if people knew how hard I worked to gain my mastery, it would not seem to them such a miracle. It seems to me that it is appropriate to quote one more time, genius is eternal patience. And when we talk about Nurlan Dalbay, these words are completely suitable for him. He graduated from a great academic school, which distinguishes him in terms of mastery. The natural image continues the classical tradition in sculpture. This is very important for him, despite the search for modern art, innovations and materials. Nurlan Dalbay understands that the creative heritage is not only in large formats, but also the inner restrained wisdom which creates the ideal beauty, which is from antiquity. Every human being has his own mission on Earth. It can be modest, invisible and very personal. But this story is not about Nurlan Dalbay. He is a sculptor, very good sculptor and, yes, genius. He created works that are destined to have a long life and they make our warm city even warmer. And it is impossible to represent Almaty without these expansive images. Bauržan Mamushalo, Abulhan Kastev, Shakir Naimanov, Mukagali Mokataev and Gerald Belger. Мне очень понятно, что когда эти люди незаметно для нас взошли на постамент. It is very clear to me that these people are invisible to us, climbed on the pedestal. These are the people who lived with us. They communicated in this city, strolled in this city. In this city they built some of their plans. And here these people entered history. And today, with enough respect, we turn to him. Ну, наверное, с достойным каким-то почтением обращаемся к ним. Все его творчество отвечает, наверное, вот трем таким вещам, которые незыблемы для каждого. All his creativity consists of probably three things that are unseen for every good work. This is first of all mastery. This is what the artist contributes, and of course the relevance of time, turning to the past, telling whether it is real. It tells about the spiritual culture of our country. Какой-то характерный такой жест, 
What is a sculptor? It is just a moment. It is necessary to understand the characteristic gesture, posture, so that the person was recognizable, and this moment, which had to be taken and recorded. And this is very difficult, because at that moment the whole image of this man had to be reflected. In this case, he is a Gerald Karlovich. Man is very complicated and multifaceted, with internal drama and it is better to catch internal loneliness. It is very difficult. It seems to me that Nurlan coped with it. He caught this moment. Gerald Karlovich is one of the few people who showed a huge influence not only on the development of literature, but culture as a whole. Это было место встречи этих великих наших людей, они все шли к памятнику Чукана, да, и там происходило вот это вот духовное общение. This was the place where our great people met. They went to the monument to Chokan, and there was a spiritual communion, a replenishment. It is important to catch this moment between eternity. He manages to make an image with all the rebellious feelings and with all the experiences. Someone is sad, someone is emotionally moved. Any monument adjacent to it is an architectural component, because it must live in the surrounding space, because it must have its own strength inside the construction. But after all, Nurlan enchanted at some images that can be immediately remembered, stayed in the hearts of people. Нурлан очень умело ее завуалирует в какие-то вот такие образы, которые сразу же запоминаются, которые сразу же остаются в сердцах людей. The past epoch has given the world a lot of outstanding people. Man with his emotions and feelings. This is infinitely interesting to Nurlan Dalbay. And now his sculptures are about people who exist in space in the world. And they have inspired life. They live over the medium. The artists created them like that. The artists who live together with the heroes of this life. Let's have a seat on the bench to Shakya Neymanov. The sculpture is located at the entrance to the Hotel Almaty, next to the opera and ballet theater named after Abai, where the great master often walked. Of course, Shakir Naimanov is a great, large-scale figure. He is one of the founders of Kazakh film. And this is the golden time of Kazakh cinema. The best films were made in this city. The most cult film, Angel in the Two, was shot at this place. It seems to me that he caught the very tonality, the very edge from which he does not turn into some monumental, some inanimate. With love, with a great artistic ability, he created the image and created the moment known to us. It is close to us. And today this is one of our favorite works. И создал вот этот момент, зафиксировал его настолько, что он просто э, настолько узнаваемый, настолько становится нам близок. И сегодня это одна из таких э, наших любимых работ. Мне кажется, это вот... It seems to me that this is an amazing ability to be transformed. Of course, it is professionalism that allows him to easily do it. This is some kind of architectural space which surrounds the object, and as this object will live there, this is all the artist provides, predicts and does at a very good level. Let's say so, the sculpture fits this city. It is more than just a statue and more than a work of art. It is a special world. People hold meetings near them, take photos with them and just come to visit. They live in different wonderful corners of our Almaty. Amazing sculptures of worthy people are a moral point of view, the place of strength and memory, the mediator of intellect and spirit, so as well as the grandiose monument of independence, a monument on the square of the Republic, in the heart of the city. Это визитная карточка города, поэтому естественно, что эта композиция несла в себе, ну, большой очень такой 
This is a business card of the city. Naturally, this composition was a great documentary layer of our history, and all the body reliefs around are dedicated to the stages of life of the Kazakh people. The monument itself, the Golden Man, Aksakal, which symbolizes wisdom, mother, a young woman who symbolizes our land. You see those children in small horses. All this is poetic, and together with the theme creating such a large memorial complex, it is human. It seems to me that this group, together with Adlia Jumabayev, they made such a significant ensemble in the 90s. Yes, of course, there were some replicas of world art history, undoubtedly, but it was done on Kazakh material. It was performed at a good professional level. He goes from the usual borders, getting near the capital. You see the monument of the power, the embodiment of our independence, pride for our country. He is the author of monumental works, which are literally eternal, large-scale, plot, epic. At the same time, the artist sees a lot, a lot ahead, for a decade. And the messenger, the task, the plot itself must take some amount of time. All the moment leaves, the essence remains, materialized in plastic. And it must be harmonious, not alien, that one could feel it. What do I like? This is freedom. Nurlan is a very free internal artist. This is very important for me, when a person is not limited to any frames. In order to achieve such freedom in creativity, it is necessary to break a lot in yourself. And we appreciate this in him. He knows his value, he understands that he is already a great master. But he never claims, here I am, look at me. Here it is very important to be a person, and because he is a great artist. He begins every work with a drawing, a beautiful academic drawing. And if we talk about a certain monument, many images are created for this. On this sheet there are lots of them. He plays with space, sees in space, already anticipating how it will look. Конечно, для скульптора Нурлана Далбая, для его коллеги, архитектора Сатыбалдиева была очень непростая, сложная задача установить of course, there was a difficult task for the sculptor Nurlan Dalbay and his colleague, the architect Satibaldiev, to erect a monument to Baljan Mamushule. He was such a man who united in himself the image of war, and a man who dedicated his whole life to the creation of the national army spirit. And this moment is a step in eternity, a step in history. Mamushule is always recognized for all his moves and the faults of his overcoat. And in that look, which is very Characteristic, and the artist presented it by a sculpture. And all the flattering of these figures make the person immerse in some good, very important thoughts. Nurlan Dalbay, this is a story. This is not a source of inspiration. He is invited to create high-quality artistic monuments, knowing his high professional training. He copes with any large-scale project. In the center of man, his mind, the spirit, 
that is reflected exactly in the classical form. Первая работа, которая у него была в Академии дипломной, это «Мать и дитя». The first job he had at the Academy was mother and child. This is also an image filled with standard lyricism. And there is his love not only for the sculpture of Renaissance, but also for all Gothic sculpture. There it is all mixed with some new trends, working on a particular moment. He does not stop at some single vernacular decision. There will always be three options and so on, and he will work on it all. Nurlan Dalbay was not just born a sculptor, and in order to stay as a sculptor, it needs for him to create, because he cannot do otherwise. Practically, he does everything himself, from the beginning to the end. His sculptures are psychological portraits, and this is a huge work. They say inspiration. In fact, it is not that suddenly knocking on the door. This is a definite look at things, an analysis. This is a kind of interpretation of surrounding reality. There is a slide, which is present in the work. To that end, impressions are acquired from various sources. The representation of the details of the image depicted is important, because these people did what excited them. The degree of the document should be the maximum. The image must be recognizable. This is a follow-up to historical truth. And yet, for the sculptor, it is important to find a place where his work will live, as for example Mukagali Makataev. Само место, на котором он находится, вот этот сквер и такое очень замечательная площадка, вот этот порывистый какой-то неугомонный, неукротимый дух, ну как говорим, Макатай. And the place where he is, this is a square and such a wonderful sight. This is a restless spirit of Mukagali Makataev. It is well shown here. He works with his hands and all the lines. They are all alive. He is not static. Mukagali Makataev is a person who was not valued for his dignity when he was alive. And task was to see and find this ecological portrait and bring it to this beautiful pedestal. This, of course, for the sculptor was a big task. Naturally, the image of this poet, embodied in his work Nurlan Dalbay, I think was very successful from the point of view of its significance and poetic halo in which he lived. He is always in the process. His conspiracy is always on a scale. At the same time, he remains a man with a subtle sense. This is expressed in his chamber works, which unfortunately are not so many. But each of them is a fruit of inspiration, a fruit of reflection. They are very philosophical. That to him as a monumentalist is not permissible. He pours into small chamber works. Ну, как бы не позволительно, как монументалисту выражать в больших памятниках, он изливает в таких маленьких камерных работах. Но он очень честный человек, поскольку придя уже в академию после училища, да, отучившись вот несколько курсов. Нурлан is a very honest person. He came to academy having taken several courses, and their talented guys were treated strictly. There was no such thing as prize. Master Nikushin was very strong. Nurlan could make the full figure, but it was taken away. They said, come on, you will do it a little differently. Yes, it was painful, but thanks to these, the artist says that he feels the aroma of the sculpture. Having mastered such an academic mastery, he travels to Germany to feel, to see something else, to bring something new to this academic network. How he works, it is close to me. Here he is sitting on a hill. He has his own workshop there. He sits there alone and enjoys it all. This is also very familiar to me. Self-digging, constant doubt. We are not sure about anything. It is doubtful all the time. 
this is very important quality. We sat down, talked about what was convenient, and maybe at this moment the most important conversation took place. How often do we repair internally ourselves? How our worldview, our understanding cross each other? How much of us understand each other? He is already a close person and spiritually close person. У Нурлана есть вот это вот, ну, так скажем, дар предвидения, который, опять же, берется из того, что он просто художник-профессионал. Поскольку, когда ты работаешь в Брузе, ты, естественно... Нурлан has this gift, because he is an artist professional. As you work in bronze, you have to anticipate all the consequences, as it will be different, as it will look like in a small work, in a monumental. Here we are standing next to this horse, which is called Danen. Danen. This is a horse four years old which for the first time is led to a meeting with a mayor. And there is an incontinence of some kind, rage. Here are the emotions that are in this little work. They are hurling. They are visible to us. We feel it. In general, for Nurlan, this is characteristic feeling. He experiences and resists these moments. He is a very cinematic character. He is a representative of the 60s, 70s. A rocker, bitler man, musketeer. How would I shoot him? I would have dressed in some knightly armor. He would sit on a horse, a nomad who does not part with his historical past. Therefore, this rebellious spirit was preserved in him. He saved his world, and now he lives in it and feels very organically himself. It seems to me that he is now in a good shape, because he worked a lot, did a lot of things, successful and not so, outstanding work. And here is such a period when he is ready to create a truly brilliant work, which will enter the treasure. Now, when we know a lot about him, yes, Nolan Dalbay is active, bright, inspired, professionally honest. Yes, the artist spends a lot of effort to express feelings, thoughts and experiences. He is like a living bridge connecting the traditions of Renaissance epoch with modernity. That is, the great predecessors did their thing, and Nurlan Dalbay follows their way, masterfully creating a gallery of beautiful images of our dear people. They are modest and delicate, they are full of openness and kindness, they have the power of talent and the personality of the most savior. This is a message to another, next time and generation.